Why hello there. Again, I'm going to try and change it up a little every time. I don't know, I might just change it all together. But that is how I actually greet people in real life. And also in my outro, if I go in a shop or see someone, that is actually, again, what I say in real life. So rather than trying to come up with a quirky quote, I figured I'd just, you know, say what I say normally. So this is the last video with content from Krakow. Uh, but to lead up to the ending, I figured I would show you the rest of my clips, a little collection of fun clips. With <laughs> We are in the Polish market and as you can see there's not much room for many more varieties. However yeah. these are my new friends that we're gonna have to leave very soon. Uh, as you can see we're all fun guys. Uh, we're all gonna get some local food and cook like a mushroom dish for everyone. So we've got a surprise. There is a dog, a dog's catwalk. Yes, you heard that correctly. Now let's see the little floofs and little puppers so my mom will be thrilled hey doggo this is just That one's wearing a princess's crown. <laughs> Welcome to my kingdom, Emperor Doggo. Oh, the two warm, bless him. Oh, that one is scared. Oh, you're matching. Sherlock Wufter? The sombrero. The Mexican security doggo. That's so cute. We give our dog a sacrifice. W tym momencie wypada wykrzyknąć nasze hasło. Przed jamnikiem uderzczołem. Jamnik górą, chociaż sami stoi. Bardzo Państwu dziękuję. Witamy na 23. Marszu Jamników. Przedstawiamy naszych jurorów. Take my dog. I'll forever hold your peace. So you have to sacrifice a sausage dog. And um, <laughs> Panie i Panowie, pokażcie się kochani w Roży, może trzy kroki do przodu mamy taki spaj... A to, Czy ja mogę poprawić ucho Bobiemu? Bobi, pozwolisz, że poprawię Ci ucho. Bobi. O, o. Nie, dobrze. Ucho już jest chyba w porządku. Z numerem 3. <śmiech> Dostaniesz coś lepszego. Od razu posłuchał. Gino, powiem Ci w konkursie, w konkurencji numer 3 na posiwiała kuka, prześliczne białe łapy i to jest pozytywne. Colour puts you off a little. 
Oh my god. Combination of flavors is unreal. Shame you can't taste it. <laughs> right. Yeah. Right, so Lucy. Looks like red wine. Yeah. Maybe it'll get you drunk. Yeah. How is it? Wait, is that a nice face? So I just to like, you. Really nice. <laughs> um, we're meant to get potato, however, we got miniature dumplings in the soup, so now she shall. Her look shall bear all to the dumpling taste. How is it? One out of ten. <laughs> Kinda like ravioli. Ravioli? Yeah. Do you worship the spaghetti god? Yeah. <laughs> it's really nice. Like really. Like I wish I had like the chunky one because I wanted all the onions. But it's really tasty. So we're about to go to the museum where the Da Vinci painting lady with a near mine is. Um, so we're really excited about that, and um, but outside at museum there's a very interesting piece. Um, there's a lot of people, so I might wait a second. But um, it's very ambience is very Fallout esque. Um, if you ever played them games, I'm sure you have because they're amazing. Um, but um, it's a collection of old things, and it's in this really cool wooden structure. So we'll look through it together. So look. There are um, various parts of machinery and um, meters and fans, and um, yeah, it's all very, very cool. Like work coats, and um, so it's all way up. There's like chains hanging and um, blocks. Oh, light's not the best. Typewriter. Rushi! I have. <laughs> uh, things on sections above, such as speakers and stuff, which are also really cool. like a spike or something so you know like the ECGs in hospitals yeah. where it's a similar thing so I don't know where you plug it in that makes me feel so cool yeah. that's like something off a film you're like wait oh you're like shut it down yeah. that's where you end get caught in and it yeah. Yeah. like ball the starts running down Shit's got real <laughs> this is, uh, why have you betrayed me son I and loved you. This is what you used to click, oh. connect. That's Fuck right. you, that's why. Yeah, well, it's it's like, yeah. yeah you know, like board. on old films, they'd be like, operator, and they'd be like, I need to talk to you, and you'd be like, connecting you now. Yeah. We have an engineer with us, and he is very clued up on Are you the, an engineer? Yeah. He is an engineer. He's an aviation engineer. So, there's a drink called Cock. The picture is a vagina <laughs> and it is, I'm not sure if you can see, coconut flavoured milky nectar that stimulates erotically restricted formula edition limited to 500 cans. There's a boob over here. Oh, there's a boob? Oh. Bust a nut. I don't know. <laughs> there's a picture of a nut for orgasm. Of what? A nut. They say, they say that you bust a nut. Uh, okay. Chesh. Hey. Hey. Do you want? Hey, do you want? Look at this, it's a boob. And then finally, we have a nipple. Fine. A beautiful, Fine. mint flavoured, refreshing and nourishing drink I'm in the hospital with so an long. extract from the breast. Yeah, the oh. We just um, almost experienced a very traumatic event. We. Um, 
get in a coach to Gdansk and it is 10 hours long and we weren't entirely certain where it was and we came to the coach station carrying his bags which were extremely heavy and so very tired so I apologise if I lack charisma or energy in this video but um, we just got redirected to like six different places I'm exaggerating slightly two or three um, and <laughs> we just ask an information lady and she was like no there's no Leo Express but she sounded Polish, not whatever accent that was. And then, um, <laughs> and then, um, yeah, so we stood, go into every single bus and coach, trying to beg drivers to point us in the right direction. They either just ignored us completely, <laughs> or um, just pointed us from bit to bit to bit. And uh, as it got to 10 past when it was meant to arrive, it wasn't there. We'd given up, we thought we were going to have to get an extra day in a hostel and um, wither and die. But just as we were about to give up and leave the coach station altogether, it rolled in, of course. So we've just sat on the coach, got a 10 hour journey ahead of us. Um, as I said, we're off to Gdansk, so we're heading straight north, still in Poland. Enjoy the rest of your day, take care and farewell.